lot sought or repair. Our Bennett GM Chevrolet is ready to rock and roll down to the pit area and we're set to go. For the mini stocks, Caitlin Moss, Mike Thompson gonna lead us to the green flag. Through turns three and four. Off of four, the loud pedal is underway. Green flag is in the air. Three wide move for the leaders at the front of the field. Wallace in the middle, Gilmore on the top, Young on the bottom. It is side by side racing. Wallace slides up just a little bit, still in the middle, three wide, and Keelan Wallace is gonna go from first to fifth. On lap number one, oh, Bobby Mercer with a big wiggle in the middle of one and two. He's going to go diving through the grass. Still under the green flag here in this one. Now that first side-by-side -side battle, Wallace in the 45 on the top, Mercer in the two on the bottom. They flash back onto the straight down to the turns one and two, still side-by-side, -side. Mercer on the bottom. Looks like they finally got that two machine back up and running and Mercer trying to put that car to good work here. And he's working on the 45 of Caitlin Wallace trying to take that fourth spot away. Oh, at the front of the field. 16 of Mike Thompson with a big wiggle off of turn four. That's gonna allow the seven of Matt Young to get to the inside and now it's gonna be side by side for the race lead. Young on the bottom. Gilmore in the mix as well. Thompson on the top. Side by side for the race lead in three and four. Gilmore with a big wiggle. They're going to sort themselves out, but Matt Young is going to take that race lead. Mike Gilmore slots in in second. Third now will be the two of Bobby Mercer as he works around the 16 of Thompson who gets the wall. Thompson up in the right rear. Off of turn two, guts hard into the outside wall. We'll see if that damage affects the handle of that 16 machine. What around and they exit of turn two of the 77 of Rory Marco. All the leaders make contact in one and two as well. Caution flag is going to fly. <laughs> to a Bobby Mercer. Jumps on the loud pedal and we're back on the way. Mercer with a big run on the bottom. And now the 20 of Ryan Edwards Kiss is going to try to follow him through as well as he works to the inside of the 45 of Caitlin Wallace. Mercer out front by about a car length and a half. As he slingshots out to the race lead. Oh, big wiggle for the 98 RJ Crow 2 as he was in the middle three wide. Tyler Lewis on the top. The 7 of Matt Young making a dash through the field. Mike Gilmore kind of come through this field as well. So action all over the speedway here, but out front, Bobby Mercer leads. Ryan Edwards kiss in second. Keelan Wallace settles in at third. Fourth will be the seven of Matt Young and fifth, the 33 of Mike Gilmore. Those two draw. Oh! Around goes the seven of Young and hard contact with the 33 of Gilmore. Caution flag is going to be on the speedway. So this time we get the white flag. We're gonna get ready to rock and roll here once again. Lots of action here so far in the first eight laps of this one. 12 laps to go. The Bennett GM Chevrolet Pace Truck's gonna make that hard left hand turn to the infield. We're ready to go once again. Mercer gonna lead the field back to green and we're back underway. Edwards Kiss in that 20 is going to try to maintain that high side momentum. Oh, the 59 of Tyler Lewis tried to squeeze into a gap on the outside and made a little bit of outside contact with the back straightaway wall as he was trying to make a look for the third spot. He's going to slide all the way back now to the sixth position. So still green in this one. Bobby Mercer out front. Ryan Edwards Kiss in second. 
Third to seven of Matt Young. Fourth to 45 of Keelan Wallace. And now in fifth to zero seven of Michael Kenny. Halfway home, halfway to go in this one. Mercer still out front. Edwards kiss in second, but he's getting the seven of Matt Young closing that ground for the second and third spot. Young has moved to within a half car length behind that 20 machine of Edwards kiss. 45 of Wallace settling in right behind him. Now Young's gonna maybe take a peek to the three inside of the 20 car. In turns three and four. Young gonna make quick work of that 20. Now move the seven machine up to second spot. Still out front of the two of Bobby Mercer. The seven of Matt Young settles in in second spot now. Third, the 20 of Ryan Edwards kiss. Caitlin Wallace though, moving a little bit quicker and she's right on the back bumper of that 20 car in that 45 machine. Then it's a bit of a half straight away back to our fifth place runner, the 07 of Michael Kenny. In the 98 of RJ Crow two and six, seven to 59 of Tyler Lewis. Eighth will be the 28 of Chris Lawrence, then the 48 of Matthew Smith, and the 16 of Mike Thompson. Thompson might be a couple laps down here in this one. 65 of Nikki King runs in 10th, 11th, and 90 of Trevor Hemingway. 12th is the 16 of Mike Thompson, then the 33 of Mike Gilmore, and the 77 of Rory Markle. 15 laps, now 16 go up on the board of this one. Bobby Mercer has opened up about a half straightaway lead over that seven of Matt Young. As leaders work around some lap traffic. Mercer getting that two machine back on the speedway here and so far so good. As he's trying to put that two back on the top spot of the podium here tonight. 17 laps into the books of this one. As he leads by a half straightaway over that seven of Matt Young. In the 20, Ryan Edwards Kiss runs in that third spot. This time off of four, two laps to go. Leaders continuing to navigate through some lap traffic. Bobby Mercer down the back straightaway around the 16 of Mike Thompson. Off of turn four, he's gonna see the white flag in the air. One more trip around the third mile, Flamborough Speedway for the two of Bobby Mercer in the clay bar contracting. Rangeview fabricating number two machine. Down the back straightaway for the final time. No lap traffic in sight. Off of four, the two of Bobby Mercer are gonna top the spot podium and pick up the future win. Second to seven of Matt Young. And third will be the 90 of Ryan Edwards Kiss. Fourth, 45 of Kayla Wallace. And fifth, the 07 of Michael Kenny. Down here in victory lane, he's going to climb for the car. Fans, put your hands together for your feature winner, the two of Bobby Mercer. We'll slide in here and grab word here with Bobby. Well, Bobby, back behind this two machine, how good does it feel to jump back up to that top spot of the podium? Oh, it feels great to be back in the car. We're still chasing some gremlins with this thing, but glad to be back in it and racing with you guys up at the front, having fun. I know it looked like it was a pretty easy drive. How did it feel from the front? How did it feel from the from the driver's seat to put this two out front, clean and green, all the way home? Uh, it wasn't easy as it looked. There's still some gremlins we got to work on when we get back there to come back for the second feature. It's still not handling right. I know you guys got a lot of support on this two machine. Who do you want to give a shout out to for getting you guys to the top spot? Well, I can't thank Tim enough, Matt, my teammate behind me for his help. You know, Clay Bar, West Valley, Blue Streak for all they do. You know, without them, this wouldn't be possible. There you go, fans. Runner applause, your feature winner, the two of Bobby Mercer. Slide in here and grab over their second place finisher, Matt Young. Well, Matt, that was uh, certainly interesting coming from the back, getting up to second spot. I know you guys had a little adversity there, but how was how how did it feel coming through the field to get this seven machine up to second spot? Well, I mean, they don't call me Mr. Excitement for nothing, right? I mean, uh, yeah, it was a heck of a race, uh, you know. We have both these cars we bring every week. Now that we got that one fixed, hey, as long as we get up here on the podium every week with both of them, it's, uh, I'm happy and I'm okay. Hopefully uh, 33 strains up for the next one. I know you guys got a lot of support on the 7 machine. Who do you guys want to give a shout out to? Yeah, obviously uh, my dad, Jack, all the guys in the pits are here every week with us. My wife's down the road camping, so she can't be here. Uh, Blue Street Contracting, Greg's Plumbing and Heating, Levine Motorsports, 
uh, Icon Air Parts. And, uh, yeah, thanks for the fans for coming out. There you go, fans. Your second place finisher, the seven of Matt Young. Slide over here with the 20, our third place finisher, Ryan Edwards Kiss. Well, Ryan, that was certainly interesting. Dicing it up there through the middle of the field. How did it feel to get this 20 up to third spot? You know, it was pretty satisfying. In uh, practice, we weren't sure what exactly we brought to the uh, track. We made some changes from last week, but uh, obviously worked out pretty well. I have to give the crew chief a raise after this one, I guess. <laughs> Extra flam burgers, right? There you go. That's the way. I know you guys got a lot of support on this 20 car. Who do you want to give a shout out to here on the car and over in the pits for you guys? Uh, I'm Jim Towns Attire and Raider Auto Parts for helping us uh, every week. All the fans are coming out tonight. It's a beautiful night for racing. Thanks for uh, for coming on out. Of course, my parents and my family for supporting it. I mean, they do 95% of the work and I just show up and race because a bit of a tight schedule, but uh, we make it work. It's awesome. Hope you're here next, uh, next race. There you go, fans. Round of applause. Your third place finisher, the 20 of Ryan Edwards Kiss.